Once you've done that part, what's your next step for diagnosis of FSGS? How do you diagnose nephrotic syndrome to say, hey, this is FSGS? You have to do a kidney biopsy, yes. You will do a kidney biopsy and what would you see in the kidney biopsy? The term, the name gives us the answer. It's focal segmental glomerular sclerosis, meaning less than 50%, okay? Less than 50% of the glomerulus segments should have glomerular sclerosis. So it won't be like universal. It will certain parts patchy, but it has to be less than 50%. So it will be focal segmental glomerular sclerosis is what you're going to see on your kidney biopsy. Now sometimes if they really want to go a little deeper, they can ask you what are the types of FSGS. Because you diagnose FSGS and there's actually five types. One, two, three, four, and five. What are some of the types you guys know of? What happens with HIV patients? What specific type do they have? Have you heard of something known as a collapsing variant? You have something known as a collapsing variant, which is what you will see in a patient with HIV. So that can be a board question. They can say, hey, patients got FSGS and patients got HIV. What is the type that's gonna be seen in these patients? Is a collapsing variant. And it carries the worst prognosis. It carries your worst prognosis. Okay, when you say worst prognosis, obvious question is going to be, well, what has the best prognosis? There is a variant which is known as a glomerular tip. Glomerular tip variant, which is going to have the best prognosis. So those are two. We got three more to go. We'll call one of them the classic, right? You always have to have a classic variant, right? So start from your collapsing variant HIV. Glomerular tip. Best prognosis, then go for your classic. You have perihilar and cellular. Now, do you need to know all these five types? I don't think so, okay? I don't think you have to waste your time memorizing it. I just wanted to put it there so it makes it more complete. But what I want you to know is, if somebody's got HIV, think of the collapsing variant, because that could be a board question, and it has the worst prognosis. And glomerular tip has the best prognosis. You have to remember two. Remember glomerular tip and collapsing variant for FSGS. If you knew all of this for FSGS, that's all you need to know.